things are going well. Then, about midsummer, or the hottest part of summer, you see your gorgeous Venus flytraps start spiraling into a rapid decline. You think your flytraps may be dying. Traps are turning brown, stems are turning brown, and they look like something is actually eating them. Better than them eating something. And this may be basically what's happening. If your growing conditions are good, it could be that your Venus flytraps are being attacked by a creature too small for them to eat. Molds, tiny bugs like mites, aphids, and other little pests, fungus among us, <laughs> okay, fungi, and a variety of other attackers. Brown spots or circles on your plants are a pretty good indicator of this. Here is a good solid broad spectrum medication. Broad spectrum in that it kills a lot of pests that might be attacking your Venus flytraps. So you don't have to pinpoint exactly which pest is responsible for the damage. I have no relationship with the maker of this product. I simply have a passion for Venus flytraps. And I've tested it on my own plants. The results were great. It killed the pests. And within two weeks, healthy new traps were emerging and thriving. Just add two ounces to a gallon of distilled water, shake it well, then pour some of this mixture into a squirt bottle, and from the jug, pour some over the center of each of your fly traps. Then spray the stems with the squirt bottle. If your growing conditions are good, you should start to see healthy new traps growing within a week or two. I've tested it for safety on many Venus flytraps, even very small baby flytraps, and on seedlings, with no negative issues. This product is a pesticide insecticide, so use it only in very small areas, and also read the product's label and warnings well. Obviously, if your growing conditions are not right for Venus flytraps, a parasite or other pest may not be your problem. <laughs>